And welcome back to another round of the Solo Survivor experience playing Dead by Daylight. We are here on the game. Survivors sent us here. Not all of them. We actually had... We actually had competing map offerings. We had a... We had a map offering from... Somebody to send us to a farm map. And somebody to send us here to the game. Oh, that's a... That's an Oni? That's an Oni chasing the only person not on this gen. I think, I think both of the offerings, I think the farm offering was from the Oni, or was from a survivor, maybe it was from the Oni. Yeah, I would like to get this done and get this door open. Quickly, yep. Like, quickly like that. Like, I don't want to be here for that. Alright, is the totem in here? No. We're running over Zalus, a perk that would allow us to do gens quicker, but we gotta break a totem. We know where a number of the totem spawns are on this map, but not all of them. And the one that is normally around the bathroom is probably upstairs in that corner, and obviously we can't get to it, but... We're gonna sit on this gen. Obviously not going as fast as it was with prove thyself and with somebody on it with us but it will just have to do as we are going to well that only is way on the other side of the map this is can we finish this gen before we get company? We did not hear the Oni pop his power yet. That's good and bad. Alright, where's... uh? All right, we got on this gen and finished it. All right, somebody got Steve down. I say I sensed that Oni was here, but I think he's upstairs chasing the Steve still. That's the Oni's power. And that's the Steve again. Oh, Steve, that could be better. We are not going up there yet until his power runs out. All right. Oh, Steve had decisive. I don't think he's going to get a lot of distance, but he did have DS. Let's hope he can get to a pallet. I'll say, we don't see too many people running DS since the, the change of the three-second stun. In that case, I mean, it is buying time. It's allowing us to sit on this gen. Hopefully, the other Mag and the Claudette are on a gen. All right. And just like that, we are on the last gen. Ah! 
All right, let's see if we can. See if we can lose him with Lucky Bright. Oh, Jesus. Just like that, all the gens are done. Wow. Just like that. Ah, we know the other exit gate is open. out that was ridiculously easy I mean I guess the Steve is gonna get out he was there at the exit you know so I mean I don't know what to say that match six minutes for five gens on the game the Oni was the one who actually sent us to the farm, or tried to. Uh, the Steve was the one who sent us to the game. Uh, he did run decisive, and again, we haven't seen a lot of decisive in play. But man, that was big. He hit the decisive strike, and that was that. Uh, that gave extra time for us to get on a gen, gave extra time for other people to get on gens and to sit on them. And for us, uh, lucky break and overcome. The Oni hit us. We got some distance on the game. It's easy to break line of sight. We went up over the top to that drop down and killers know that that's a difficult room beneath there. And, and the Oni just basically overcoming lucky break at that point was basically a give up perk for the Oni. And uh, geez, that's, that's a brutal match for the Oni. But uh, whatever the case may be, we'll take four person escape. Anyone who says you can't escape this killer, well, I, there you go. Or a can't escape a survivor. There you go. That's a quick, quick four out. Barely enough time to get into the match, and all the gens were done. Hope you enjoyed the round. Please consider hitting the like and subscribe button while you're here. We have games that actually go longer than this on the channel. It would help the channel to grow so much. And you can check us out on Twitch at the link below at Geriatric Gaming 11 and get notified whenever we're live there. Till our next time, thanks again so much for watching. Have a wonderful day. We'll see you in the next Dead by Daylight.